Oh, those somber Vikings fans are coming back home now. Yeah, flight started rolling in early this morning from Philly. Ellery McArdle joins us from MSP International this morning. Ellery, what are the fans you're running into, Sam, to say? Yeah, well, Tim and Alicia, it's more of what fans didn't say. They were very quiet after they got off those two Sun Country flights early this morning. You could see their heads were down. They were sad. They just really didn't want to talk, and they were probably sleep deprived as well. They just wanted to get home and wish that this was all a dream to them. So I want to show you video of fans getting off of those flights. Uh, they were still decked out in their purple and gold. The first flight came in at about 2.45, the second one at about 3.45. Some automatically talked with us about how hopeful they are for next season, but most fans are still processing that the season is over. They gave it up. They didn't, they didn't give what they could have given, and, and we deserved better. It's a damper on everything, yes. <laughs> Not interested in going to the Super Bowl anymore. Now, despite the loss, uh, many fans we talked to said they had a pretty good time at the game, but they were stunned by the encounters that they were having with Eagles fans. They said the Eagles fans were taunting them, teasing them, throwing things at them, and at times it got violent. We're going to talk more about that coming up at 530, guys.